up you guys? Yes, today I'm doing what all the cool kids are doing and I'm going to do a 99 cent store haul. Now I was doing this way before the cool kids were doing it. I did one of these maybe two or three years ago and that was just for YouTube. I've been going to the 99 cent store since I was a child. When I was a kid and everybody was getting those Tamagotchi pets, I went to the 99 cent store and I got myself a Gucci Kamikachi pet. Which now that I think back on it was probably a cockroach that I probably found in the cheese aisle. But I kept it alive. It lived in my house for five years. Anyways, yes, today I have a bag filled with treats and we are going to see what's in it. Now there's a mixture of a lot of different things in here. Food, there's games. It's basically like a birthday party. A really bad birthday party that nobody wants to go to. It's like my birthday party. <laughs> hey, did you not get the invitations I sent out to my birthday? Oh! Yeah, I got them, I just didn't want to go. Like I'd rather actually die than go to that sad, sad, sad party. You sad, sad, sad man. Cool, good talk. Okay, these are, oh. Ooh, sorry, you just saw all my emotions at once. These are called confetti eggs. Now basically what they do, I guess, is it's made of real eggshells and then you can smash them on people's heads and confetti goes everywhere. This is gonna be awful and a mess and I'm not gonna clean it up. Oh, well, let's do it anyways. By the way, the Spanish name for these are cascarones. That's what I'm gonna call my balls. Ooh, actually, can you stop licking my cascarones? It's very ticklish for me, I'm not into it, but you could lick my Assy holes. All right, which one should we do? Ooh, it's like galaxy. Uh, let's do pink. Oh my god, these are like handmade. Ooh, that made me sad. <laughs> I just thought about a bunch of people in a 99 cent store workshop just making these. Oh my god, how much do they get paid? Because I know normal sweatshops are like zero dollars. If you're working for the 99 cent store sweatshop, that's like negative dollars. That's like you pay them. Oh, that's so sad. Let's have a party. <laughs> Ouch! Oh my god! That fucking hurt my head so bad! That was not fun. Why did I do that to myself? Let's do it again! Maybe there's a better way to do it where it's not like directly on my head. Alright, let's try this again. Ow! Yeah, that's a party. Ooh, ooh, that was pretty. If only dandruff looked like that. People would stop throwing up around me when I scratch my head. Right, well, that's just gonna stay there for the rest of the video, so enjoy. You guys can't see this, but my lap is just having a party. Really living it up down here. It's like I got a lap dance from a really sad clown. All right, next treat. Oh, uh, no. These are seaweed snacks. Now listen, I don't even trust seaweed snacks from like authentic Japanese stores or Ralph's. So a 99 cent store seaweed snack, <laughs> this is gonna be rough. Oh my God, they don't even call it a seaweed snack. They call it an ocean snack. You know what that means? It means this is not seaweed. This is literally the Doritos bag with a turd floating in it in the ocean. And they're like, oh shit, just grab that. Just like chop it up and you know, just die green. Oh God. All right, let's give this a try. Roasted and lightly sea salted. Please, that's just a nice way to say somebody pissed on it. <laughs> oh my God, that was intense. That hit me hard. <laughs> that hit me harder than that fucking egg. Which, by the way, I might die after this video. Because don't you, like, die after you get hit in the head? Like, it hits you later? Like a concussion? I don't know. Will Smith? Who knows? All right, here we go. Ew. Oh. Ooh, it's kind of pretty. Like, I don't want to eat it. Like, I want to wear it. I mean, who is she? You know what I mean? Oh, wait. Hold on. I mean, honestly, fashion icon. I mean, Ricky Dillon who? <laughs> All right, here we go. Oh, oh, oh. Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh no. Oh no. Ooh. Huh. The texture is toenail. Wet toenail. Toenail that has been soaking in the tub and then you cut it off when you get out because your toenail is so long and so thick it needs to soak. And then you take that butcher knife or you take that big serrated blade and you just skim that toenail off the top. And then you take it and you just play with it a little bit, you know, and then you eat it because it's a part of you. Like that's what this tastes like. And then like a few days later, you're like, what is in the back of my teeth? And then you pull it out you're like, oh my God, it's my toenail from three days ago. That's what this is. Or if you're a normal human who has no idea what I'm talking about, it's just gross. Shopkins! I have seen these all over the internet. I mean, why have I seen these all over the internet? What am I searching for? <laughs> Whatever, I've seen them a lot. And basically they're like little toys that people make videos out of for some reason and they get like bajillions of views. So, welcome to my toy video. Hey everyone, this is Shane, Toy Girl 69. And today we're gonna be opening up this Shopkins. Ooh, listen to the bag. Ooh, doesn't that sound like your parents showing you this video because they don't want to parent you? Yeah, are you at the Cheesecake Factory right now? You are? Yeah, and your parents are ignoring you while they eat their factory nachos and they just leave you alone with this iPad because they don't want to deal with your annoying screaming? I'll be your parent 
gal, let's kill your fucking parents. Yeah, you see that knife on the table? Yeah, you see that? Why don't you grab that fucking knife? And why don't you take it to your mommy and slit her goddamn throat? Yeah, let's do that. What am I doing? <laughs> I just created a horror movie and I love it. All right, let's see what this shit is. Ooh, what the fuck is this? What is that? Why is its face upside down? Oh wait, there we go, that makes more sense. Actually, no it doesn't, it makes less sense. Why is it an ice cream cone but it's upside down, its face is upside down? Ooh, with scary little unproportioned arms. You know what? Everything at the 99 cent store is kind of fucked up and that's why it's sold there. Like it's things that are kind of messed up or broken. So this has a deformity and they sent her to the 99 cent store. That's so mean. You should love everybody no matter how deformed they are. You shouldn't just throw them at the 99 cent store. This bitch deserves to be a target with her friends. And instead, she's at the 99 cent store, sitting in between a bottle of Fabuloso and condoms that don't work. You know how sad she must be? Almost sad enough to kill your parents with you. Hey, are they still breathing? <laughs> Cause if they are, we should change that. Okay, I'm gonna stop. What the fuck is this? <laughs> An egg shooter. How interesting, that's exactly what I have. My sperm destroys eggs. <laughs> it doesn't make babies, it actually kills them. My sperm is so gross that the eggs <laughs> Really weird. The eggs scramble instantly. Oh my god! Oh my god, did you see that? Hold on, I just did something on accident and it was amazing. Wait, ready? Oh! Oh, but it's connected to a string. Oh, so you don't lose it. I need this for my life. You need to connect my iPhone to a string, my keys to a string. Honestly, connect my dick to a string. Oh, then it's like a puppet. Oh my god, like a marionette. I'm gonna do that later after this video. Ooh, ooh, that was a good one. Oh, I'm gonna have so much fun with this. This is a great first date idea, don't you think? So what do you do for a living? Just kidding, don't care. <laughs> no, I'm kidding. Love me, always, never leave. Ooh, this is another one. This is called a flying disc. Well, it's not the best name, but you know, I know it's Alright, so what does this one do? Ooh, okay, so you put the disc on the carrot. Oh, okay, twist it, and then I guess you... Really? You're gonna give me that high octane, crazy fucking egg launcher, and then you're gonna give me that sad little twisty carrot dick. <laughs> oh my god. It's exactly how sex is with me. Cause like foreplay is amazing, and then they get that sad twisty carrot dick. <laughs> and then they want their 99 cents back. Next! Ooh! Watermelon frosting! This is another example of something that just didn't work in a normal store. And like Betty Crocker done fucked up. Like Betty Crocker's had some hits, you know what I mean? Like she kills it with the cookies, she kills it with the funfetti. And then you know, once in a while she throws a watermelon at us. And then you know, we send her ass to the 99 cent store to think about what she did. Alright, well, I'm gonna give it a chance, cause maybe it's good. I mean, we all know how much I love watermelon flavor. Oh no. Looks like Play-Doh. Smells like Play-Doh? Oh, ew! <laughs> oh my god. Spits out the side like Play-Doh. All right, let's try it. Oh my god. That is so awful. <laughs> I can't even put it into words. Oh my god. It's like leaving like a pack of like gross watermelon gum in the back of your car for eight weeks. And there's a body back there. And they're rotting together. And like the flavor of the body gets into the flavor of the gum and then it becomes one big gummy mess. That's this. Betty Crocker, this is your last chance, girl. We're done with you. Honestly, Betty, go home. <laughs> oh my god, this Jesus candle is everything. <laughs> I love a good Jesus candle. His face literally looks like a meme, doesn't it? Like, when mom says she doesn't want to take you to Taco Bell. When your teacher says you have extra homework tonight. When your friend spoils the ending of Pretty Little Liars. It's literally like, ugh face Jesus. And I love it, I relate to it. Ooh, this is cool, I'm so excited about this. This is a color changing mug. So I guess when you add hot water to it, it fucking changes. I wish that was life. <gasps> that would be so fun. Like, you get into the shower and you come out a whole nother person. Although, I have seen people who have done that. Like, they wake up in the morning and you're like, who are you? And then they get in the shower and you're like, oh, yeah, you're way too good for me. Go home. All right, so let's put some hot shit in this. All right, here we go. All right. <laughs> um, nothing's happening. <laughs> Hello? Oh my God. <gasps> I am going to scream. Oh my God. It's like a fucking horror movie. Oh my God. But it says I love you. Okay, if it was a horror movie, it would say something like, get out of the house. <gasps> that. Fucking awesome. I'm freaking out. And then does it go away? I wonder if we just pour cold water on it. <gasps> oh my god, look. Oh my god. 
How is that only 99 cents? That was one of the best moments of my life. I almost want to end the video there, but I still have more stuff. All right, let's do a couple more things. It's not going to get better than that. Okay, so I got these not even to try, just to show you guys the box, because I thought it was so funny. <laughs> Look at that. It says paradise. <laughs> it's just three fucking piles of shit. Actual human shit. <laughs> like, that is not chocolate. That is literally in my toilet right now. I worked hard for it. I want to look at it all day. Don't judge me. So we're not going to try that because I already know what my shit tastes like. All right, the last thing we're going to try, I already know I love Takis. Oh my God. If you don't know what Takis are, they are these little... Oh shit, these little rolled up corn chips. And they're hot and they're spicy and they are so good and so fuego. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. All right, I literally have no purpose to try these on camera except for the fact that I just want to eat these. So let's do it together. Oh my God. Fuck. No sponsor para, por favor. Sponsor. I just turned French. <laughs> it is so fucking good. Jesus, you want one? Ugh, when you really want Doritos and it gives you Takis. All right, then fine, you don't get none. I'm just kidding, Jesus, I love you. Uh. All right, y'all, I'm done here. This has been a great day. The mug, the Takis, the Jesus, all killing it. All right, you guys, hope you enjoyed this video. Uh, make sure to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe because I make new videos every single day. And I'll see you, little 99 cent store shoppers, tomorrow. Bye. At one time in my life, I was a fan of Tootsie Rolls, too. But then I grew up. I changed my perspective. I realized that they taste like dog shit. And I moved on to real chocolate. You hear that, Debbie? I moved on to real chocolate. A real woman. I moved on to Sarah Lee, bitch. That was mean, I'm sorry.